All right, Mason, grab yourself a hockey stick. Let's go. Give me this. This is this is Mason's stick. Come on. Oh, look, Mason got you his very own stick. Yay. All right, Mason got you a stick. What's up guys, in this video we're doing three fun stick handling drills and we're gonna start super easy. Mason, you should be able to do it. And then uh, medium and then advanced, I don't think he'll be able to do the advanced one. Now this whole video is based on fun drills. If you think I missed one, let me know in the comments what is your favorite stick handling drill. Maybe I'll put it in the next one. But these are three stick handling drills that, I don't know why, they're just they're just fun to do. It's like you just gotta mix it into your routine. So if you have a stick handling routine, you're sticking it at home, try these out. Number one fun drill is very simple. That's why it's easy one. You can do it with a puck or a ball. I'll get Mason a ball. Boom, thank you. Here's what we do, we're gonna do is just start with the puck at the heel and you're gonna roll it to the toe and then catch the toe and reel it to the heel. And all you're doing is spinning that puck. And I don't know why it's so fun. So Mason, do it like this with the ball. So you're gonna start here, see this? And, and you're gonna try to spin it. So I'll show you with the ball. So you start with the heel and try to get it to spin. How fast can you get that ball spinning? And you don't really, whoops, <laughs> you don't really want it to move back and forth. You kind of want to see if you can keep it on the same square. And just keep on spinning it and spinning it and spinning it. Spin, 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 spin. Oh yeah, oh, hey, get out of my way. Try one more time just by yourself. Basically, let's try to keep it on this square. See that little square? So if we can kind of pull it, there you go. You can get it going first. There you go, now try to keep it just on one square. That is tricky. So easier, I guess, for the more advanced players, but it still requires some skill. So go out there and try it. Mason, let me see that spin. Yeah, there you go. And then back. Get it spinning. Get, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. He got it. Yeah. There we go. There we go. He's got it spinning now. Took a second, but Mason figured it out. So that's our first fun stick hang drill. Was it fun? Okay. That is our first fun stick handling drill. I don't know why I find it so fun. I think it's just like the faster you can get that thing going in the smallest amount of space. It's like a little bit of a challenge. And if you wanna add some difficulty to it, you can kind of mix that around as you're going around your body. So don't just do it in front, but you know, start with it here, right? You're, you're spinning it and then try to spin it back here as well, right? So you're kind of working your way around the body and then you can do it while you're stick handling or while you're moving down the ice as well. Let's move on to a second one, a little more difficult now. Mason, this one is a big challenge for you. Second fun stick handling drill. This one is medium level difficulty, a little bit harder than the last one. We're gonna stick handle with two pucks at once. So you're gonna try to control both of these. Let's do a little bit of a, we'll start on one side of the rink. Oh, Mason says it's easy. Okay, we're gonna start down here. Here's the trick, when you first start, just you know, do whatever you can to control them, but as you get a little better, try to make it so they don't stop moving. They're both always moving. That's the real challenge. Let's see, nice and easy. Just use one and then the other, the other one. Here we go, stick handle down the ice. Oh, go oh, nice and easy. Woo, woo, woo. Here we go. Boom. Never lost it. Oh, there we go. Let's see how amazing this. Yeah. <laughs> Changing the game. You gotta do one and then the other and keep working your way down here. There we go, keep moving. We gotta get the other one. There you go, nice. Keep moving. Try to do it while you're moving with both of them. So, yeah, bop that one forwards and then grab the other one. There you go, and then get the other one. Stick in on once, twice, move that one forwards. Oh, a little bit of mental math going on here. Try to figure this one out. He's making some progressions, there we go. Okay, here we go, here we go. Keep it going, keep it going. Try to keep those feet moving. Nicely done. And he's there. All right, so that is the moderate level difficulty. As you can see, uh, Mason did a great job at it. Good job, buddy. And what you can do as a more of a challenge is just keep your feet moving, right? So at first you might be a little bit slower. See if you can do it without stopping, right? Just go on and actually let's, let's bump this one up to a little harder. Mason, I'm gonna make it even harder for you. Ready? pumped up the difficulty level here. We've got obstacles now. All right, let's try it. This is drill two and a half. Same drill, two pucks at once, but going through an obstacle course. And obviously, you're not allowed to hit any of those pucks. A little, a little trickier here. 
All right, ready? You think I can do it, Mason? Not a chance, eh? Let's go. Oh, 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 here we go. Not quite as smooth as the first one, but you get the idea. You can make it as uh, easy or as difficult as, as you want. And obviously the pucks uh, did slow down a little more, but I'm gonna try that again on the way back. That's actually pretty fun. Shoot, work on touch. I know, I touched one of these black ones. Woo, 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 woo. Ah, no, the toey. See, that's great, especially with this obstacles. You have to have quick reaction speed. I saw the puck is going towards one of the, or the green biscuits going towards one of the pucks. I want to get that quick toe drag in, quick recoveries. Wherever the puck ends up, you got to make a quick uh, decision how you're going to move it around. So great drill there. Let's see how Mason does. Let's keep moving. Nice. You only got 10 more seconds to make it through. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one, he made it! <laughs> there you go, so if you want to uh, add another element to it, add a bit of a time limit to it. So you had 10 seconds to make it through with both pucks. The last drill, advanced difficulty, we're combining a toe drag and a backhand toe drag in a sequence. There's no way Mason's gonna be able to pull this off but we'll try. Let me show you what it looks like first. This one's pretty tricky, but it's really fun to use all the parts of blade, the toe, the heel, the backhand toe, and the backhand heel. So we're gonna start with a toe drag back, all right? So we're gonna toe it back. We're gonna catch it there and push it out. Then we're gonna toe it back in towards the body. We're gonna push it forwards. And then right here, we throw in the backhand toe drag across, and then you're back again. Start with a toe to the side, like that, all right? So just keep on getting those toe drags. You're pushing them away from your body, pulling it back in. Away from your body, pull it back in. Away, pull it back in. Now we're gonna do it forwards. So you push it forwards, pull it back. Push it forwards, pull it back, all right? So that's one, right there. We can go two, right here. Working on breaking down these movements. All right now, let's combine those. So one, two, one, two, one, two. There we go. All right, so you've got that portion of it. Now we add in the backhand toey. So it's one, two, three. All right, so that backhand toey is just a backhand smack of the puck. You're smacking the back of the puck. All right now we go. Okay, one, two, three. One, two, three. So it, you create a sequence, toe drag, backhand toe drag, toe drag push, toe drag push, backhand toey, toe drag push out, toe drag in, backhand toey. And you just keep on going over and over and over and over and just speeding it up until your mind just explodes. Mason, do you see that, Jill? Easy? <laughs> All right, ready? Let's see if I can pull it off. And I've got no tape, right? So barely any grip here. Already making the excuses. Ready? Oh, ready. Toe, toe, backhand toey. It's actually interesting. I find those backhand toe drags, if you try to do them slowly, it's kind of hard. Like it doesn't really come. You really need to commit to like that smack. <laughs> while, it's, while the puck is moving, you have to commit to smacking it and bringing it across. <laughs> you try to do it slow, it's almost like that puck just doesn't move for you. You really need to kind of give it a, a crank. See that little tap right there? And it's all that, that top hand right there is really doing a lot of the work. You gotta get it away from your body and then smack <laughs> that puck. So it's boom, see that one? Oh, that was a nice backhand toe right there. It's like you're gonna shoot and then boom. You come over the puck, give it a smack. If you're finding it difficult to complete that backhand toe drag, maybe that's why you need a little extra speed for that snap. Let's try to get it one more time. Backhand, toe, toe, backhand, toe, 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 backhand, toe, 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 backhand, toe, toe, toe. Ah! Okay, so you get the idea. I could probably use a little work on there. Um, Mason, he says it's gonna be easy. Come on up. You want me to run it by you again one more time? Nope, he's got it. Toe drag, and then push it away from your body. Back, catch. Yeah. That's good. Now you're gonna push it away from your body. Push away, yep. Now roll your hand and pull it back in. There you go, now here's the difficult part. You're gonna push it forwards, but you're gonna smack it with the back of your blade across. That's the backhand toe drag. 
There you go. So it's kind of like you're drawing an owl. There you go, nice. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four. All right, I actually find it is easier with that puck. When I smack it, it kind of get, grips the puck a little bit more than the green biscuit. It kind of slipped off with the no tape there. So those are your three fun stick handling drills. Let me know if you found them fun. If you didn't find them fun or you think you have a, a better one, a more fun drill, let me know in the comments or just shoot a video and uh, tag me on Instagram. You know, toss in your stories, tag me there. And we will include that in our next drill because we want you guys to be having fun out here training, getting better at your skills. And uh, hit that subscribe button, hit that follow button. Share this video with your friends who play hockey because we're making new training videos every single week right here on How To Hockey. Uh, if you want some merch, huh? Hey, you wanna look good out there at the hockey rink? We got some right down there below this video. Click there, ask for, for birthday, Christmas. You know, you gotta spoil yourself. That's it for this video. Go out there, have some fun, train, improve your skills, and we will see you in the next video.